I managed to drop over 200 kills in one game with my updated PPSH class setup. That setup will be at the end of the video. We gotta get straight into the gameplay. Now, I did make a PPSH setup at the very beginning of Vanguard, but obviously I've learned quite a bit. I know the attachments a little bit better, so I updated it, and goodness, man, way better than my initial one. You are not gonna be disappointed in what you see, man. I mean, this was just absolutely insane. Super fast pace, action packed. Overall, just one of my best gameplays I've ever gotten. Let me know in the comments, what would you rank the PPSH on a scale of one through 10? One being the worst SMG in the category or 10 being the absolute best. And let me know why you rank it where it is. All right, I think it's like a solid A. It's actually really, really good when you get the right attachments on it. Without further ado, man, here is my new PPSH class setup in action. All right, we got my updated PPSH class setup in Vanguard. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I have not use this weapon since eh, i, I want to say since the game came out because i got gold camo on it but it has been a very long time if you guys remember if you've been watching we made a video covering the ppsh and vanguard literally like day two or three of the game being out and this is one of the final weapons you unlock so hey you got to respect that grind that we were able to cover it so quickly here's the guy here but obviously I've learned quite, I, I say this all the time, every time I, oh, the range is beautiful. I say this every time when I cover a weapon that, or two piece that I haven't, you know, used in a minute or since the game came out. You learn, man, you, all, you, you live and you learn. So I now know what's good and what isn't on this thing. I've learned the attachments pretty well. So I feel like I can give an even better class than I did last time. Oh my God, I almost ended up dying. This thing definitely has a whole lot better range than it did previously. We're off to a off to a good start. No way he actually sat there and watched that. Damn, I almost got bopped. I got like one of my favorite maps ever. Dome. Dude, this is such an underrated map. It is a gem. A gem. Alright, I'm scared to move. Nice. Dogs up. We're one off our local. This should be big. Nice. All right, cool. We're keeping it cool. We're just playing this one safe. I don't want to go anywhere that's going to get me killed. I'm just going to play for my nuke. Dude, I love him so much. I never get to play it. I, I need to make the most of this match. I really do. I'm going to lock in and try to get this. Oh, my God. Like, oh, my God. Where the... I want to lock in and try to get my, my my nuke here. I need to make the most of this. I love this map. And I want to share my love for this map with you guys. Dude, look at my... I'm getting literally long shots right now. Like, this is the biggest... Oh, he's pissed, bro. This is the biggest, like, little bitch spot ever. I'm not going to lie. Like, excuse my language, but... <laughs> I'm, I'm playing like a... Oh, they're, they're... Dude, it seems like a... Dude, it seems like a squad of little kids. That's what it sounds like. Little do these guys know. They're about to get nuked. No, I got to put ammo down. Hey, you got to teach them young. I ain't going to cap. You do got to teach them young. All right, they got a... I'm just going to go over here. I got my local up. I, I shouldn't be playing scared, but now they're... Oh, come on. Put that out there. Yeah, where are these guys at? Come on, I'm trying to like... I want them to come to me. There we go. I think we need like two kills for this V2 rocket. Dude, I feel bad, man. It's a bunch of little dudes. That's, that's, damn. I don't know what to do here. This is a, such a rough spot to be in. No, nothing. Dude, I don't even know what to do here. Oh my God. Come on. I don't want to peek that. Damn, bro. I feel bad for sitting back like this, but nice. I think I need literally one more kill for this nuke. Oh my God. I, I really want to get this because these guys are like little dudes. I got to hear the reactions. I really do. The middle. Yes, there's my atomic. All right, hey, I'm sorry for sitting back as much as I was. Let, let, let's get on our feet and keep it going. I'm going to move around now a little bit. Let me show you guys I can win gunfights running around. I, I, I got to prove that. Nice. And just like that, maybe we got ourselves a V2 rocket. I could literally just try to, I guess, chill on the floor over here. Nice. 
They said what? Why did he spawn there? Oh, these guys are so cool. <laughs> oh, dude, when I call in this nuke, these guys are going to be astonished. They got home from school, didn't even do their homework. And now they're getting stomped around in Vanguard. All right, we're on a good gun streak. I'm actually like, I feel like I'm doing pretty well here. Dude, they're all up there. Yeah, no wonder. Come on, man, they're all just sitting back. No wonder why this game's gonna end so fast because they're not moving. Yeah, they're all just sitting there. I'm just gonna throw that out. No! Bro, they're all over. Come on, all right, dude, we have three and a half minutes left. We need to stay off the objective just for a little bit. Give me a little bit of time. Let me try to pop off just a little bit. We have so much more time left. What am I at? 50, 50 something kills? I should be able to get like 100 or something. All right, they also have the objective on them. Oh my God, they're just getting messed up. They're stuck in this little corner here. Yeah, the PBSH is really good, man. I mean, you guys can see how accurate mine is. And Come on, cross the map. And that's just from ranking it up. I mean, you're gonna get way better attachments when you rank it up. A lot of the weapons in this game, they're really not all that good when, you know, you don't have anything for them. So I highly recommend just getting some attachments unlocked and it'll be all good. Nice. All right, I gotta call in my nuke. Dude, that's not my nuke. Wait, there it is, called in the nuke. All right, I gotta hear the reactions. They've been raging all game long. I just have to hear what they're gonna say. Oh my God, we are frying right now. See, I had to sit back a little bit for the nuke, but I mean, you guys can see we're, we're winning gunfights and whatnot. Running around. It's all good. Next game. Oh, did they leave? No shot. They rage quit. If you guys are brand new to the channel, make sure you guys subscribe for more best class setups and crazy gameplays like you're going to watch today. And drop a like on today's video as well. It only takes a few seconds of your guys' time, helps push the video out, and gives us more exposure. All right, a little bit of Das House domination. You know for a fact, we gonna get a lot of kills this game. Oh, let's see what we can do. Damn, he just full on just rushed me like that. All right, it is what it is. And with Das House, this is just a get a kill, die. Get a kill, die. That's just kind of how this map works, so. Oh, shoot. Damn, those guys are literally just everywhere on the flag. So I apologize if I just, you know, run and die, run and die quite a few times, but. That's just sometimes how the map is played. It's all good though. We're gonna make the most of it. Nice. Let me know, do you guys actually enjoy Das House? Cause there's surprisingly enough people out there who don't even enjoy this map, which I can completely understand, man. It, like, it's kind of like how Nuketown was in, in previous Treyarch games. Not everyone likes the smallest map, you know? It's just not everyone's cup of tea. So let me know, do you guys actually enjoy playing Das House? Or is it just like a, eh? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass on that one. I need to hide for a second. Damn, I gotta reload. These guys are kind of out of line right now, which kind of sucks. Nice. Nice, we got dogs already. Awesome. All right, we're, off to, we're doing pretty well. I just need to stay alive and get my local, and then I'll know exactly where everyone's uh, called the local in. Wait, dude, they're spawning in front of me? God damn. Huh? Nice. Oh my God, we are frying right now. This is great. They got a glide bomb. I got to say, stay clear of that. Huh? These poor guys were just getting messed up. Oh my goodness. I'm on a 19. Dude. Hey, the PPSH on this map is a different breed. Nice. 23. We're doing very well right now. I just got to stay alive. I literally just need like two kills. We already have a, a V2 rocket. And then I'll probably just play a little bit more. There's our atomic. Later! Hey, that quick of a, a... Okay, I need to go for a bunch of kills, I think, now. We got a we got a nuke, which is awesome. But this could probably be one of my higher kill gameplays. If I just... Yeah, have a great time. If I just continue to pop off. Hey, teammates! It's all good, actually. I want to earn dogs again. See, after I get a V2, it's like hard for me to like want to keep trying. Cause like, I just want to go for more kill streaks. That's always the best thing is when you can continuously earn your kill streaks. That's like one of my biggest issues with Vanguard. Like I wish I could earn another set of streaks after I earned the first set, you know what I mean? Let me just keep being rewarded for being alive and going on a crazy kill streak, you know? I need to earn dogs. 
All right, I need to stay alive. I need to stay alive. PB. I'm a little nervous because these guys could literally attack me from any way they want. Okay. Nice. Okay, we got dogs. Oh my goodness. Holy. Oh, I almost called B2N. Attack dogs in just like that, baby. Hey. I'm so glad I updated my... My clock. Later, dude. Just get, get bunny hopped. I'm so glad I updated my class setup for this weapon. Again, it is so, so important, man, to just continuously look at your setups. Maybe be like, eh, I need a little bit. It's kind of like a recipe, man. Add a little bit of that. Remove a little bit of this. And you guys are you guys are good. Dude, I am in such a terrible spot. I can't even call my... Uh, nice. Oh no. Oh my God, they got a counter UAV up. I can't even call my local. I was previously rocking like the, the ooh, right on the side of me in blue. I was rocking the iron sights, the special iron sights, but then I'm like, you know what? Let me try a slate reflector because not everybody enjoys iron sights on, uh, on the weapons in this game. So I'm like, eh, let me use something to make cater to more people, which, you know, an optic site, it does exactly that. A lot of people like for an optic just so they can see a little bit more clearly. And I actually really, really like this. I feel like we're just popping off a lot more. Last nuke is a little bit slower, so if you guys don't like that stuff, this one's for y'all, baby. Let's go. Oh, shoot. No. All right, I think the... I can, I, okay, I can finally call Sin. Man, I cannot wait to use something like this PPSH in, in Warzone. If you guys don't know, the integration where, where they add all the Vanguard weapons in a Warzone is in like a week and a half or something like that. Maybe maybe less than that, like kind of like close to a week now. But I am beyond excited for that. Like that's what I'm really looking forward to. Man, if you guys don't like Warzone, you're going to have to play the new map. It, it's a whole new experience. You're not going to run the cheaters because they're going to have an anti-cheat. There's going to be a new map, so if you don't like the old map, guess what? New map, anti-cheat, a bunch of new weapons to use. You know, we got all the Vanguard guns. It's just going to be a brand new experience, and I feel like you got to give it a go. You're, you're going to have to try it out. I know I am going to. I actually, I didn't play too much of uh, Verdansk or Warzone previously, but I think it's be a great opportunity for me to get into it just a little bit. Okay, wait, I think we're on another nuke streak. Why do they have another counter? I have a hundred kills. Nice. I'm just lasering. Oh my God, I'm zapping. Do we have a hundred kills at halftime? This could easily be a, a 200 kill gameplay if I desire to be too. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Those gentlemen just lined up. Oh my god! I'm just, dude. I am just blitzing their spawn point right now. Oh, I'm dead. Mid map, dude. 126 kills. We might actually be able to break our. Oh sh. I might be able to. Oh, I, you know what? I really think I should lock in here a little bit. This could actually be like one of my craziest gameplays ever. Hold on. I don't normally have to lock in too much like that when I play Vanguard, but. When you're going on a streak like this, where you could really put something together, man, you got to lock in for it 100%. I want to earn my dogs again. Those are important. Those could get you a lot of kills too. Nice, dogs are up. And just like that, we're good. I'm still going to let these guys hold these, these flags. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god, the spawns! We almost had another nuke. 157 right now. On the UAV. We got another set of dogs, I think. Call them local. Boom, that's up. Nice, we got three. Yeah, we have to get another uh, set of dogs. Those things just pop off. It's unbelievable. Put that out. Yeah, there's a bunch there. Those are free kills. Nice. All right, I need two kills for dogs. That's it, just two. That should be quite literally nothing. There we go, we got dogs again. Let me see if I can get another local. 
Oh my god, this. No. Minus 15. Oh my god! Dogs again? Cool, we just gotta keep getting those. And we'll be good. Dude, 185 kills. Just a PPSH. <laughs> Holy cow, dude. Just like last week, we dropped like 223 or something on shipment with the uh, MP40. And now we're about to get another crazy gameplay with the PPSH. Oh my God. They're all just sitting there. All right. All right. We have so much time left. We'll basically be at 200 kills with 50 points remaining in the game. Uh. No, I, I do these kind of these are so annoying because I like to call my I like to rely on my radar There we go. I love to rely on my radar a lot. I should have maybe let him capture B. I'm not gonna lie That probably have been smarter huh? I am alive. That's all that matters. Yeah, I like to rely on my radar because then it just shows me where the enemies are at It's just easier to It's just easier to understand everything Maybe. Okay. Call that. Okay. I got my dog. That's all that matters to me. Let's get out of that. No, no, no. Okay. Calling the dogs. Boom. Oh my god, another 15. 213 kills. Hey, if we get somewhat close to 300, I'm gonna hurl. Quite literally, hurl. These guys need to capture B though. Nice. I'll just sit in the corner for a sec. Nice. Okay. Oh my god. Nice. We still have a lot of game time left. No, I had to turn around and do 227. This might be one of my most. No way we get our PR here. All right, that's my my local. All right, let's back up for a sec. Damn. Okay, Put that out. Those guys are all there. Nice. Okay, I got dogs again on those. No, we're, we're dead. 243 kills. You would be up. Dude, I ain't never had a game like this in my life. I mean, I'm not even joking. 246 kills. I might be able to get my my new personal boss. No, I'm dead. Let's call her nuke. W, we got it in time. Oh my god, that was clutch. Nice. No, I died to that. 251. I don't even know what my most kills is in this game. I don't even know how much it is. I'm dead behind. Oh my god, this has to be is this it? That's a terrible throw. Oh, that is the best way to end it. Let me give you this class setup. 257 58 now. I don't know what that came from. 258 kills. So here's my updated PPSH class setup. Starting off with the very first attachment. I threw on the strife compensator. We get plus one recoil control. The recoil on the PBSH, it's a little wonky. It's a little weird. So we're going to need to make this thing a little more accurate. And we're starting off on the right foot. With the barrel, I threw on the very last one, the ZAC 300 millimeter. Basically, it just maintains the power of the PPSH at medium and long range engagements. Uh, the bullet velocity and range is what helps make it a powerhouse of a weapon at those long range gunfights. We get increase in accuracy, recoil control. Again, just making the weapon have little to no recoil, which is great. So you get best of both worlds, great range and great recoil control. For my optic, I threw on the slate reflector. I mean, just your basic red dot. You can throw whatever you want on. Um, previously, I was rocking the iron sights. I know it's not everyone's cup of tea, but um, slate reflector got the job done. I really enjoy it. For my stock, I threw on the Zac folding. So with this, we get initial accuracy and recoil. So right when we start shooting the weapon it's a little more accurate than it would be when you're just holding the trigger down and shooting for a while uh, we also get a little bit of mobility with the ads speed so we can lock on our targets pretty quick and hopefully just get the first shot off and that kill for my under barrel i mean you know the same thing as always the m1941 hand stop plus one recoil control plus one accuracy we're good to go now all right this thing is literally a laser beam with all these recoil control attachments we should be good to go 
For my magazine size, I threw in the largest one, man. 71 round magazine on the PPSH. Now, I know with the Russian short, you get 35 rounds and, you know, increase in damage. Below. That's all great, but this thing burns through ammo, especially for someone like me who loves to play very, very aggressive. I'm going to need that very large magazine, and it did come in handy. You guys saw some crazy feeds in the gameplays. For my ammo type, I threw in lengthened. Again, just to increase my range... Plus, your bullet velocity is great because uh, the bullets travel a lot further without dropping off, and they can connect to enemies a lot quicker. Once again, just making the PPSH that much better at medium and long-range engagements. For my rear grip, I had to throw on the fabric because I had no mobility whatsoever with the setup, so I needed a little bit of something. So with this, we get aimed on sight speed, we get sprint to fire speed, so my weapon comes out quicker after sprinting. That's more than enough. You guys saw, I mean, my weapon was pretty fast, so... Um, I got to give it to Fabric Grip. By proficiency, I threw on Fleet, increase the movement speed, so I'm a little bit lighter on my feet, and weapon swap quickness for all my uh, fans of YYing. You're going to love that. And then for the kit, I threw on Fully Loaded, so I don't got to worry about ammo. And there is my updated PPSH class setup in Vanguard. And if you guys are interested in my perks and whatnot, uh, here they are. We got Fortified, Forward Intel, and Lightweight. 250-something kills. Like, bro, what? Give this thing a go, play a handful of matches, and let me know in the comments your best gameplay you managed to get with it. How many kills did you get? What kind of kill streak did you go on? I'm going to be reading through the comments, dropping likes, hearting them, and replying to some of you. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. Stay safe, and I'm out. Peace.